Aside from the, the vibe and just the positive fact that he came back, how much does he change the core? Because he can run the routes and stuff. He definitely, I mean, he does. He, he's got, he runs great routes. He might be the best route runner I've ever, you know, played with. I mean, he is the best route runner I've ever played with. And he brings a, you know, teams kind of fear that whenever they're, whenever he's out there. And I think he brings that to the table as well. What do these seniors mean to you? Uh, they've been, they've been awesome. Uh, they've kept this team together through all the adversity we faced this year. Uh, a lot of teams are falling apart, and I can't thank them enough for everything they've done. I'm glad we could send them out the right way. In two starts, two wins. How would you evaluate your, your progression the last couple weeks? Um, yeah, I think there's some things I got to work on this week. I, I wasn't really, honestly, I wasn't really that pleased with what I did today. Uh, I think there were some some little mistakes that I, I really got to fix um, in, in order to be successful in the future. It seems like you're more confident than four touchdowns. Definitely felt, felt a lot more comfortable. Just like some little things that personally I, I just think I need to fix, but um, I do feel a lot more comfortable back there, and uh, it was a fun day. Was the offense having struggled for much of the year? I mean, what does it do for you guys to reel up? Five straight touchdown drives like you did, and then halftime. That was huge. I mean, you just kind of keep building off of it. You know, once you get that one, and there's momentum, just you can feel the momentum. And we just kept going, and it was like we're going out there, we're expecting to score. And it was, it was huge to get the momentum going. After the Miami game, you guys talked a lot about the positive vibe and keeping the spirit up and the focus and all that kind of stuff. But what does two wins do to that? Uh, yeah, so like we've been talking about, they're, they're going to remember November. That's kind of been our saying uh, this past month. And, uh, that's that's the thing, you know. We want to we want to finish this month out strong and, and keep it rolling into the next next season. How big is it going into the next week? Like after the coach comes in, pretty much your bowl game. Yeah, it's gonna be a big game. Uh, they've got a great team. I mean, I haven't really watched any film on them. I've just you know seen ESPN and stuff here and there. Um, I know they've got a great team, and we're gonna have to we're gonna have to play our best game. You said it, Coach Fedora said it, but in practice, how have the seniors kept this team together? Is it through action, through words, or what have they done? this process? Uh, both. I mean, they're all of them are very vocal leaders. I mean, they're, you know, MJ, Austin, Bentley, all those guys, they're just, they're always keeping people together. And, you know, if something's wrong, they're going to bring us up and they're going to talk to us about it and we're going to get it straightened out. A lot of those guys are injured. How have they kind of stayed involved and integrated? Yeah, I mean, they're still, they're still involved. They're still in the building. They may not be out there in practice, you know, but they're affecting this team in the building, in the meetings, and, you know, a lot of other ways. What did you see with Austin in terms of being determined to come back and play again this year? I love it, man. That was awesome. I have a lot of respect for that. He could have easily just packed it up and said, I'm going to you know, get ready for the for the draft or the combine, and you know, I'm done with this. But you know, I have a lot of respect for him for doing that and coming back and you know, trying to do the best he can for this team. I really appreciate it. When did you learn that you would be playing today? Uh, pretty sure I learned like, at the beginning of the week. Uh, I thought he was going to play last week, but he ended up not, so I wasn't really sure. And then uh, towards the middle of the week, I you know, pretty much made it clear.